What is emptier than empty? Imagine a void so vast, so dark, and so lonely that it makes the vastness of space seem crowded. A hole so enormous it defies all conventional wisdom about the universe. Well, NASA just found it. In the midst of the void, there is nothingness, not a single star, not a single planet, not even a flicker of light. This hole is 330 million light years across, and it's the largest one ever discovered. But what's even more mind-boggling is that it's completely devoid of anything, a true void in every sense of the word. In the emptiness of space, NASA has stumbled upon a hole where nothing exists. Join us as we delve into the mysteries of this cosmic abyss and discover what NASA has uncovered in this vast, black emptiness. Let's begin. The vastness of space is both awe-inspiring and unnerving, and it's not surprising that we often focus on the positive aspects of it. But did you know that some of the best theories for the universe come from the emptiness of space? Back in 1923, Edwin Hubble demonstrated that the universe was much larger than previously assumed, and since then, scientists have been discovering new and exciting things about the voids in space. One such discovery was made by Robert Kirshner and his team of astronomers at the University of Michigan in 1981. While building a 3D map of the cosmos using redshift, a measure of how quickly something is moving away from Earth, they stumbled upon a blank emptiness 700 million light years from Earth. This area, which was roughly spherical at around 330 million light years across, had hardly any galaxies in it at all. It was so empty that it was dubbed the Big Nothing and later became known as the Boots Void. The Boots Void is a ghost town in the galaxy that you won't see even if you stare at the neighboring Plowman constellation and the Big Dipper. If galaxies are cities, then the voids outside would be its suburbs, while its interior would be its most remote wilderness. But just because there aren't many galaxies there doesn't mean there's nothing of interest to be found. Researchers have been venturing into the vast black wilderness of the void, and by doing so, they're discovering new, more powerful dark entities in our universe. We have only discovered a handful of galaxies inside the emptiness, but the Milky Way is part of the smaller Virgo supercluster which has about 2,000 galaxies in it. Our nearest peer, the Andromeda Galaxy, is visible to the naked eye because we live in the Milky Way. But it would be much further away if our galaxy were in the Boots Void. The universe is often compared to a cosmic web at very large sizes, with unseen dark matter strands supporting the brilliant structures of the cosmos. But consider it instead as a cosmic foam, like soap bubbles in a bathtub. Galaxy clusters concentrate in the walls, filaments, and intersections, and much of the space in between is empty. The boots void was simply too large, which was the issue because the gravitational pull of the matter in the universe keeps the galaxies from flying off into oblivion. But even though the void seems lonely and desolate, it is an essential piece of the cosmic puzzle. Without it, the universe would be incomplete, like an atlas without the voids in between the cities and roads. In addition to its vast size, the Boots Void also has some other peculiar features that have captured the attention of astronomers and cosmologists. One of these is its extreme emptiness, which is even more pronounced than in other cosmic voids. In fact, it has been described as one of the most sparsely populated regions of the universe, with a density of matter that is about 20 to 30 percent lower than the average for other voids. This emptiness is not just a curiosity but it has significant implications for our understanding of the universe. One of the most surprising things about the Boots Void is that it challenges some of the fundamental assumptions we have about the large-scale structure of the universe. According to our current models, the universe should have a fairly uniform distribution of matter, with galaxies and clusters of galaxies spread out evenly across space. However, the Boots Void seems to be an exception to this rule, suggesting that our models may be incomplete or inaccurate. Another interesting aspect of the Boots Void is that it appears to be relatively isolated from the rest of the universe. This means that it has not been significantly affected by the gravitational pull of neighboring structures and may represent a kind of cosmic desert that has been left behind by the evolution of the universe. 
Some scientists have even speculated that it could be the remnant of a collision between two large galaxy clusters, which would have cleared out the matter in the void and left it empty. Despite its apparent isolation, the Boots Void is not entirely empty. There are still a few galaxies and other objects scattered throughout its expanse, including some that are quite massive. In fact, some of the largest galaxies ever observed have been found within the Void, suggesting that it may be a unique environment for galaxy formation and evolution. Now, let us take you on a journey through this mysterious cold spot of the universe, a riddle that has puzzled astronomers for years. This region, located about 3 billion light years from Earth, has fewer galaxies and emits very little energy compared to other areas in the observable universe. It's like a vast emptiness, a cold spot measuring a whopping 1.8 billion light years across. But fear not, for modern technology and supercomputers have allowed us to create in-depth models of how the universe evolved from the earliest seconds following the Big Bang to the universe we see today. This means we can start to understand how our universe got to look the way it does by comparing these maps with simulations. The Dark Energy Survey, for example, has mapped out a quarter of the southern sky while looking at about 300 million galaxies. However, this peculiar region of the universe confounds astronomers. Our theories on the formation of the universe do not account for such a vast and frigid spot. It is roughly 2.7 degrees Kelvin colder than the cosmos as a whole while areas that huge only differ by one or two degrees elsewhere. The most straightforward explanation was that the cold spot was simply an unanticipated void, an area with few galaxies. But in 2009, researchers surveyed extremely remote regions of the universe in that direction and found no voids. So what could it be? Some researchers hypothesized that the cold area was caused by mistakes in the analysis of the cosmic microwave background data while others controversially asserted that it might represent proof of a parallel world. The CMB is heat energy, a byproduct of the Big Bang that is constantly whirling across the entire cosmos. As researchers studied the CMB, they discovered this sizable region in the direction of the constellation Eridanus, which has shockingly low energy. The latest study reveals that the enormous region includes about 10,000 fewer galaxies than anticipated, implying it has comparatively less matter overall than other regions in the observable universe. But this still doesn't explain why it's so cold compared to the rest of the cosmos. It's a riddle that has yet to be fully solved, and the excitement of discovery continues to drive astronomers to explore and uncover the mysteries of our vast and complex universe. We can explain the vast expanse of the cosmos as a gigantic Swiss cheese. The cosmic cheese has holes, representing empty spaces devoid of matter and gravitational attraction. But what happens to light particles like photons when they enter these voids? Well, as they travel through the emptiness, they lose energy, but regain it when they leave. However, as they exit the void, they enter a medium that is less dense, resulting in weaker gravitational attraction and lower density. This causes the photon to lose some energy, resulting in a lower temperature. This is why the area surrounding the void is cooler than the rest of the CMB radiation. Scientists have long speculated about the existence of supervoids to explain these frigid regions. In 2007, radio astronomers claimed to have discovered a low-density region, but visible wavelength studies disputed their findings. It wasn't until researchers expanded their observations of the sky that they were able to create a 3D map of galaxies in the direction of the cold spot. This revealed a massive gap with fewer galaxies than anticipated, making it the biggest structure seen in the universe to date. While promising, this study is prone to errors due to different assumptions. It may be necessary to make changes to our cosmological theories and models of gravity to fully grasp the nature of these voids and cold spots. But as we enter a time of data-driven discovery, we have the opportunity to reveal novel and fascinating insights into the nature of the universe. Also, the study of the super void in the cosmos is an exciting area of research that continues to yield fascinating insights into the nature of the universe. However, further research and more comprehensive maps are needed to fully understand the nature of voids and cold spots in the cosmos. As our data-driven discovery capabilities continue to evolve, we can expect to gain even more profound insights into the workings of the universe and perhaps even make changes to our current cosmological theories or models of gravity. As we continue to push the boundaries of scientific knowledge, 
the mysteries of the cosmos are sure to reveal themselves in ways that we can only begin to imagine. What do you think the discovery of the largest void in the universe tells us about the mysteries of the cosmos? Do you think there could be even larger voids out there waiting to be discovered? Share your thoughts in the comments. Make sure you subscribe to this channel with a bell notification if you enjoy watching our content. We upload some awesome stuff here, which you will most certainly enjoy. Hit a like on this video and leave a comment below. See you guys in the next one.